Hey, my name's Lamar Scholl. I'm from Direction to Success. How's everyone doing today? So what I want to talk about today is how to stay motivated, especially when it comes to your online business. Motivation is one of the things that are going to take you and help you succeed. You know, this is hard because motivation is pretty short lived, right? You might watch videos like motivational videos. You just get done watching a good movie, right? But how long does that last? It only lasts a short time. Probably by the next day, all that motivation is gone. But you know that this is the thing. This is one of the keys that are going to help with your success to drive you to the freedom, the lifestyle that you're looking for. Now, what I want to do, I'm going to talk about three things to help you stay motivated. But before I get into these, you know, I want to talk a little bit more about what you need to do to be motivated. It's sure it's good. You got to read books. It's good. Hey guys, how, how, thanks for joining. You know, it's good to stay focused on your dream. But one thing that I've known, I paid probably just like you guys paid for courses. I watch videos. I read books. But like I said, those only help so long. The one key to help you stay motivated is by taking action every single day. Believe it or not, that's all it is. The other stuff you need, absolutely. I'm not saying you don't, but it's the one thing. Taking action is going to help you stay motivated. Now, another thing that's probably not helping you with staying motivated, there's three things, right? And the first one is maybe your identity or your brand. You know, this is basically staying motivated in your online business, right? Maybe your identity or brand isn't quite clear, right? It basically, uh, an identity is what do you want to be known for? How do you want to per be perceived on the internet? right? What do you want to become an authority in your space? What is, you know, what is something that you want to be an authority on, right? So if you're not clear in these things, it's going to be hard to create a clear message for other people as well, right? So this is something, you, you know, you're not going to sit down even today or the next hour and figure out. This is something you need to do and take time though. Figure out your, an ident, you know, your identity and brand. That's something, the clearer you are with that, the, help, the easier it's going to be for the next two things I'm going to tell you about by staying motivated, all right? So, like, your identity. Just think about it. What legacy do you want to leave behind? You know, what do you want other people to know you for? Now, you might be thinking, well, I'm not even sure. Well, this is where you have to start digging deep, right? And I'm going to help you with this. And that's kind of where it's going to bring me to number two. Number two is you want to create a list of things that you get inspired by. These, these things, these items are going to help you to become motivated, right? Think of activities that motivate you. And again, you have to sit down and create this list. Why? Because the times that you are not, mo you are not motivated, you're going to come back to your list. And you're going to start doing these activities. And it could be anything, anything at all. It could be, you know, maybe listening to some music in the car on your dr ride home or something like that, right? Something to get you motivated. It could be, you know, another video by Les Brown, Jim Rohn, Bob Proctor, right? It, it, whatever it is, but you've got to write these down. Don't just think you know of them because like I know when I first started, like I used to think, oh yeah, I've got stuff in my back pocket, but I really didn't. And at the times I needed it, I couldn't think of what they were. So the list is a good thing to just go to, you know, just put it in word or it doesn't matter. Put it on a piece of paper, but somewhere where you know you can find it. And the other thing you want to think about when you're doing these things, you know, find things you're passionate about. What do you like doing? Maybe it's taking a hike, right? Or just going, getting a massage, whatever it is. But write these things down. You got to know what these are. So number one, we talked about your identity and brand. Be clear on this. So, you know, how do you want other people to perceive you? How do you want, you know, what's your, you know, what type of authority, what space do you want to be an authority in, right? 
What's your legacy? So along those lines. So this number two was just come up with a list, compose a list of activities that get you motivated. All right. Number three, you want to take daily, I mean daily action steps for helping you get motivated, right? So you're going to go back to that list we just talked about in number two. What are the things that fuel you to keep you motivated? It's, you know, so you're going to have to do this every day because, you know, every day you work on your business, if you're not motivated or you don't do much, right, you're not going to see the results you want. So first, you have to get motivated, you know, every day every single day so you want to engage in these activities on your list that often right and it's hard right it's it's just hard to stay motivated because it's it's such a short lived thing right it it's just one day it's there or for those few minutes you're like watching a book or or reading a book watching a video i should say right and then it's gone. But now what you want to do is really you've got to force yourself. Use that list. This list is going to get you motivated because this is going to be the key, the key to your success. Now, you're going to know when you're on the right track. You're going to know because you're going to feel more excited, right? You're going to feel like, you know, just more you know just more engaged and things like that you're going to be coming your whole mindset's going to change you're going to start coming from a mindset of gratitude right being grateful so that's these things i'm telling you have helped me and it's just these three things you have to keep in mind the list is huge that's your key don't think that you have you know these things make sure you got them written down because i used to think that i had in my back pocket and i didn't but that list has helped me so those days when you're not feeling inspired motivated to work on your business you're tired you know we all work have other things going on in their life but you got to come home and take action your business every day and if you guys want to know just how i stay motivated every day just let me know just say hey lamar send me the motivation info just down below if you if you care i think it's great this is something that has totally turned me around before like i used to do a lot i still do you know used to think i did a lot with motivation the mindset but what i've been doing lately i've been seeing results much better results in my business i don't have those excuses like i used to being too tired or i don't feel like it today i used to push things off until tomorrow now i don't think that way anymore i, I think i've got to get them done today because tomorrow i've got something else to do all right my name's lamar scholl I'm out, and I'm from Direction to Success. We'll see you. Thanks for coming.